Spell card now. Yep, he's got the Charizard, we got the Blaziken, we have a lot of fire Pokemon in this game. I guess they gotta make it hot somehow. <clears throat> I mean, we're starting out. So we got his trusty safety frog. We're kind of using a Mulga, which I mean, always did a lot of work from his breaks and so I'm sure it'll do a lot more Charizard. Uh, that's punishable, but uh, it's kind of hard to punish unless you grab reaches all. Who so realizes he's gonna lose the counter work, so he backs up. Kano gets uh, him with a flamethrower, another flamethrower. Mulga we'll for pressure. Puma we'll able to jump that Mulga, but almost gets caught in the counter, but not quite. Tries to get out of the seismic house, but does not. Alright, knocking Kano out of the air from that fire punch. through the count uh, counter right on time. Fumu not given any- You gotta survive 18 more seconds and I'm sure his burst doesn't last that long, but I don't know if the Kano's shield will either. If it stays this way, Blaziken I believe wins because I believe he has less HP. If you can catch Picano in here. There we go. Oh, yes. oh no! Picano's shield was blood red. If he had some way to break it, he probably could have taken that. Or have he had he taken some way to break it, he probably could have had a crap. But it's a bracket, we're learning. Or I guess a free bracket, I'm sorry. I probably should make that up on the stream. Alright, Fumo unfortunately cannot charge that move in time to break through the counter. Picano does a funny funny game in the corner. Uh, I get I don't know. Charizard intimidates you so much, I'm not sure if Funnikin has a lot going for him. But it's it's kinda crazy. Boomo in trouble this round. Choose not to stay in the corner, get right out of there. Alright, there we go. There's the punish right there. Blast through Fire Punch. I'm not sure if that Heat Wave was on purpose, but he gets out of that super fast. Sky Uppercut catches Charizard. All Fumu has to do is probably land a really good- actually, yeah, he's like one move away. There we go. That's the move we need to take this round. This is still game one. It's a lot of effort for game one on a free bracket. What's going on here? Kind of trying to zone Blaziken out, which is a little strange for Charizard, but Charizard has okay moves. Choose to burn their own HP in different ways. Seismic Toss in the corner! Cool. Taking a little far back. Fumu not taking mix up, goes into burst. Picano, uh, uses Fennekin, which, I mean, you can punish, but it's not easy unless you lab the snot out of it. Or you have a beam, which uh, last I checked, Blaziken has none. So, uh. Grab mix ups. We give him Picano a taste of his own medicine. Fortunately, that gave Picano burst. He's now free to combo into Seismic Toss if he can land the confirm. Fumu gonna put a little bit of pressure on him. Make Picano run out of burst just a little bit faster. Oh, pounce Picano out of his burst attack. Most of Charizard's pressure is now gone. Unfortunately, he's enraged. I look forward to you for Fumu anyway. Great Bird will be caught by that flamethrower. Safety Frog comes out. Picano backs a little bit. Now Picano wanting to get away from the grab mix-up decides to push buttons. Then Fumu catches them and will take the first game. What will Picano- he's a- uh, oh he's- he's helping- I feel like I can hear the, the, the uh, headphones occasionally cut out, but maybe I'm crazy. 
Darkrai, okay. Picano has mentioned he feels pretty good about this uh, matchup. At least Fumu's play skin, I don't know who necessarily plays. Uh, Fumu does uh, kill my Darkrai, so clearly there's a difference in between the two. Our Darkrai is because uh, Picano doesn't waste any time with traps, he just starts, you know, pushing buttons that do things. He does get a hands and then throws it out. Fumu almost gets caught by hands, but... But anyway, okay, see, here's one of the differences between me and Picano. Picano's not afraid to just go in and do ult without Nightmare. He's, been, he's gonna keep playing Darkrai like he's every other character, even though he's got, like, half of the moves that. Catches Fumu's Wata -ta, -ta, ta with a regular counter. Alright. Zooms under Blaziken with that counter attack. Fumu knowing he can just, like, high stance this all day. Con I feel like he could have just kept zoning, or Fumu could have just kept standing back the entire time and probably waited for Picano to um, do something that did actual threatening. That actually threatened his ice stance. Uh, like, I don't know, uh. What the heck was it? Anyway, uh, so those, um, clones will catch Fumu. Unfortunately, Picano doesn't actually go into nightmare mode, uh, which would have been a little bit more intimidating, but he's doing pretty good now. He's got the life lead, four seconds left. Fumu's got it. I, I don't know if you really- Oh! There we go! That's- that's the last second comeback. That's crazy. Fumu gets a dive kick and really snatches the life lead away. Uh, interesting exchange. Fumu decides to counter Picano's, um, buttons, but Picano pushes grab. And that wins. Kind of the unofficial, like, grab when you probably shouldn't person here. They kind of keep setting up traps, and then they keep overriding each other because the Dark Ray can only have two. And Fumu goes through them with a jump forward Y, I think is what that is. I'm not sure. But it works. And Fumu's got the advantage, kind of, but Dark Ray now has burst. And he got him. And now Fumu has burst. So they're about even. I would say Blaziken might be better, although Dark Ray has some pretty nice stuff to knock Blaziken out of the air. If it would be Fumu's too reckless. Is that going to catch Please Shield? No, he can't shield! Catches just a little bit! But this is the weak version, so Fumu's A-OK. -okay. Good, but not deadly. Interesting. Okay, so yeah, Fumu does have enough time to go into burst. Choose some chip. More importantly, grab that speed boost and book it. Book it around the hands of death. This is actually really close. I think Boom is, yeah, Boom is in good shape. He's got to finish this off. Double watch the tie into a wall combo. Blazing's happening. Now, see, if any of us were good at ducking, this wouldn't be working. But oh no, Picano's got a combo going. Kind of. He gets the kick and he takes the second game and he will take this set 2-0. Yeah, Picano's gonna do the cool thing. Yeah, wait till it goes to the camera.